fountains of flow like a water. Church is the place that blood of Jesus flows like the water. Listen to me. Church is a place of testimony. Testimony and the miracle. Church is a place of the testimony and the miracle. A place of solution. Church is a place of solution. Church is a place of healing. Listen. Church is a place of the truth. You cannot get it any other place. That's why the Bible says you will respect even the parents in your Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Church is a place of what? Healing. Truth. Place of revival. Church is a place of revival. A place of signs and wonder. Church is a place of signs and wonder. George is hands of God. It is the place we learn how to bow at the master's feet. Matthew 21 and 13. And he said unto them, It is written, My house shall be called the house of them. It is written, My house should be what? Called. going to illustrate to us a little bit of the secret of the church. <coughs> Listen, as I said, it's a place of solution. Church is a place where you can find everything that speaks of fear. Hallelujah. Yes. When you enter your house, that's always the place you have some time. Maybe in the night, only you, only you. Now, every the room that nobody, only you. Sometimes you will go inside you. That sometimes you don't want to feel that like whatever. Fear. Yeah. Sometimes you feel there's a presence that I there. There's a presence in your house that scares you, that makes you afraid. Hallelujah. But in the house of God, it cannot happen because there's a divine security here. Hallelujah. Amen. So, one of the things that you gain, the Bible said, King Pesquia went to the church to tell all the kids they molested him and presented unto him a letter that he never want. So I don't know what exists in your life that you hate. So this man go to the house of God. Why? He believed as a king that above kings. And that king that above kings, the worst we are in church. And that's why he leaves his house and goes to the church. He already looked at his cabinet, his wall, the people, king's makers, and he cannot tell all this case unto them. But he rather took the letter to the church, to the house of God, to say, God, I behind this in your hand because I know that you are the Lord of the lords. You are the kings of the kings. I know too well that I'm the king, but I know you are greater than me. And that's why I bring this issue before you. Second Kings, you can write down Second Kings 19 and 14. And the Pesquia received the letter of the hand of the messengers and read it. And read it. And the Pesquia went off unto the house of the Lord. And spread it before the Lord. He spread it before the Lord. We are the church. Are the church. Listen to me. It was in the church that the king saw locate his destiny. Am I talking to somebody? Yes. In the church, the king saw locate his destiny. The Bible says he were looking for what his father's animal that got missing. He was wandering everywhere. Where will I find it? Where will I find it? But not knowing that the Israel, even as they are crying and say, we need a king. We know, Lord, we are the kings of all But we need another one. We do what we respect here. Yeah. So there's a searching. A searching. And you know what happened here? Saul found 
himself in the congregation of the prophets. And that congregation of the prophets got no, uh, is the one church. They are in the church, in the garden, in the place of the prophet, there is one church. And the Bible says, he will at their meeting. I don't know what is asking. It might be the missing animal of his parents. But another thing happens. Before he knows, he began to prophesy in the church. What he never knew before, he started to prophesy. And that's why some of you never speak in tongues before. You don't know what the tongues means. Even if you are taking it in a different thing, but the way you can receive the baptism of the Holy Ghost is in the church. Are you hearing me? That's what you see. Thank you. Because it was you was invited. That's where you receive it. And the Bible said, this man began to prophesy. And people who know him before began to ask, is that so we know? The church is a place of change. It's a place of change. So it's not about who you are yesterday. When you come, you see transformation. And I do say the time with that number. That's why the many bozas were on the back of the bozas today. Without church, you cannot return the back of the bozas today. No? You understand what I mean? There are so many bad that you do. And as you are hearing, as you are hearing, hallelujah. Amen. First Samuel. First Samuel 10. Chapter 10, verse 10. Hallelujah. Amen. And when they came at, to the hill, behold, a company of the prophets met him. And the Spirit of God came upon him. And he prophesied among them. He never said. And it came to pass when all that knew him before time saw that. All that knew him. After this month, anyone who see you will say that you're a different person. Yeah. I mean, yeah, amen. Yeah. All that know him before time. Hallelujah. Yeah. Behold, behold, he prophesied abroad among the prophets. Then the people will say one to another, What is this that is coming unto the son? He saw also among the prophets anyone who see you after this month will surely see the glory of God. Yeah. Will surely see the glory of God. Yeah. If you believe it, you can hear. Listen to me. House of God, church, is a place of giving. I don't know what you have. We have had many of them we cannot say. There are many healings, many testimonies. Yes, we know about Jennifer. That they said that she's going yes. to die after six months then. Yes, they took her to many hospitals, checked on that many machines. And they confirmed, really, she's going to die. But the prayer was said here in the church. And she go back as God instructed. Go back to the doctor. And that the day of the appointment she went in. They start to carry her from one place to another place. From oh, yeah. I saw her one of the day at the street. Yes, I look at her and say, I shake her. Thank you, Jesus. How many years today? But she's still alive. Oh, there are yeah. still some people that die of the cancer. Yes. There are many that die of the cancer. Yes. Many that die of the cancer. Yes. But her own case is because she came and fought at the feet of the master. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Listen, listen, the problem we have is that the worldly people are more knowledge than us. The worldly people are more spiritual in other way of receiving. And they never complain. They never complain. They never complain. Will I say which one and the other one? The woman with the issue of the blood receive her healing in crusade. Crusade can be rightly be called church. Huh. Huh. You don't know where they're chasing you away from the church. Okay, look at a man. The Bible said the name man is a man with Pharaoh. He's a great man. He has all the money, but he has leper. He was smooth with the leprosy. Yes, Pastor. Yes, 
upon all he is and what he has, upon his condition, that he was a leper. I don't know the life here that they have joined with beds. If it happened that your life is joined with beds, only what you need is a master fit. Yes, Am I talking to somebody here? Oh, yes. So look at this man, he leaves his place, Surya, and by his sake in one Israel, and he loaded it and said, if this happened, because I have looked around. I have gone everywhere. No solution. That's some solution that God cannot solve. That is such a case he has. Yes, Pastor. Hallelujah. That is such a case. That you don't know that you cannot use the money to marry. Uh, if you marry a man because you pay him money. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> So that you marry me. Ah, so there's some case, there's some case, there's some situation. Money cannot solve. And this is what happens to this man. And the Bible says he will search for the house of God. Oh, I'm not talking to you today. I'm going to read this. And stood at the door of the house of his Elisha. Then said, And Elisha sent a messenger unto him, saying, Go and wash in Jordan seven times. Ah. Go and wash in Jordan seven times. He sent him to the Jordan. Where do he go? In the house of God. You can come here and we say, take the holy water. It has healed so many. Yes, Pastor. Yes. Yes. Holy water here has. Yes, Pastor. This man was thinking that as I get here, as who am I? The man is going to lay hands. He complained about it. There are so many ways that healing comes in the church. Yes, yes. You don't know this. The healing can come from the opening prayer. The healing can come from the Sunday school. The healing can come from the choir administration. It can even come when the testimony time. Yes. So some will say, mm, let me just leave it. After praises, after open prayer, after Sunday school, after... Uh, your own angel that sent for you might be that an opening prayer that is going to give it to you. You don't know who God is for God, God to wait for you. Mm. For God to wait for you, for you to keep God waiting. Who are you? Mm. Who are you? Everything respecting. Yes. You don't know that what happened in the water was the presence of God. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. yes. Moses had the rod. But the presence of God, the same day, the Bible said that they peel out the fire somewhere and the smoke that guided until all the Israel did the fire from the earth dry land. The presence of God surfaced before the water. And water, but the Bible says that the wall, like a wall. Thank you, Jesus. Like a wall. Thank you, Jesus. Who owned this month? Who owned this month? The month of my surprise. The month of my surprise. The only place you can find it is in the house of God. The house of God. House of God. House of God. Let me continue because of time. Because I'm going to postpone this church. This week, you are going to know really deep what the church means. It's not a place of anger. Every provocation of anger are from the pit of the hell. Because they already know that you are going to receive. I'm still going to talk about the genuine pastor and the, uh, uh, the genuine church and the good church. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So, church is a place we find all our missing things. Ah, church is a place we find all our missing things. Jesus said, I come that I might give life and give it more abundantly. Do you know the real place that Jesus landed? The church. 
all the event that happens, miracle and testimony that happens, it was in church. He used the boat of the Peter and created a church. Ah, somebody didn't understand me. The first time he captured Peter, he used his boat as a church. He met with Peter and said, please, can you give me this boat? Can you give me this boat? And Jesus and Peter said, yes, I'll release it to you. And the Bible says he stood before that boat, and the congregation were at the shore, they were at the land, and he was there preaching and telling the people what happened in his kingdom. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, yes! Let it be that it's already ordained. That the reason why he had that crusade or why he created that church was because of the Peter. Because it was recorded that it's only Peter that got repented. Among all the whole people that gathered here that day, yes, it was only Peter. Yes, Pastor. Because it's the Peter that said, I'm following you. Master, I may say, who person? He confessed it. He was in his knees. Peter was in the knees. He claims. Lord, Lord, I cannot walk with you. The church is already created here. He said, I cannot walk with you. I may say, oh man. Do the Bible say that Peter is a God that I know? I may say, oh man. I cannot walk with you because my sin is too much. And Jesus was talking to him. He said, there's no amount of sin that I cannot wash out because I have a clean object. I have a clean detergent that the air that I produce is in my hand. Church is a place you find your missing thing. Is there any of your thing that the enemy has stolen? Is there any of your thing that are missing? The only way you can find it, and you don't know this, you don't know this. You cannot find your missing car. You cannot. Ah. There's some glory thing that the enemy has taken to you. Your missing car, you cannot find it sometimes in God. That some people that are here today, when anything comes, they say, I'm missing. I'm missing. That is true. I'm missing. Some thousands of people were encouraging, say, Go and do this here. They never even tell them how to be at the new place. How can it be that somebody has a dick? The first thing they say is that, Go to the hospital. Yeah. Uh, Just 
church. This is what many what they will hide for church. On our news, he hide it. He hide it. Ah! Sometimes this say pass me wrong. Until I'm this, I began to search it and I can get it. Once I get it, I'll just stand up. That thing already means. 